I should never be compared to Kobe. And in my opinion, I don't think you should put compare any players. And this was on the jump after losing on Sunday. In my opinion, he shouldn't get too down on himself. He dropped 40 back-to-back, -back and he couldn't really do that much else. He had, like, one bad performance in this whole series. I would say this more lies on Chris Paul. and I, You could put the blame on Devin Booker as well, but even still. And I don't think you should compare players in general because they're only similar offensively. Kobe and Devin Booker are very d different defensively games. So I think that Devin Booker could get there one day to Kobe's level, but who knows. I'm not really sure if he ever can, though, because that's going to be a tough task to ask for him if he is. Giannis goes and wins this championship and wins finals MVP. I will bow down to Giannis. I will call Giannis a top 10 PF all time, knocking on the door of top 5 PF of all time. In my opinion, he's already in the top 5, but top 10, I think that's kind of disrespectful. In top 5, this is how I do it. Number 1, Tim Duncan, obviously. Number 2, Kevin Garnett. Number 3, Dirk. Number four, Giannis. And number five, Karl Malone. Because I would put him over Karl Malone because of the MVPs. If he wins this, he could maybe dump, jump Dirk and maybe Kevin Garnett. Who knows? And he's also younger than those guys when they won their first championship. And I think that Giannis, he could definitely... I think he has the best chance to win finals MVP today. And I think that the Bucks are going to beat the Suns and close out the series. And I think Giannis is going to win finals MVP. And the score is going to be 104 to 102.